Hey guys, Aubrey here. Today I'm doing the Eureka Math Grade 2, Module 2, Lesson 6 homework. So let's get started. Measure each set of lines in centimeters and write the length on the line. Complete the comparison sentences. Okay, so I have my ruler here. So let's see, measure each set of lines. So line A, let's start at zero. That's about 14 centimeters. So let's just write it here, 14 centimeters and line b we start at zero it's 10 centimeters 10 centimeters so line a how much longer is it 14 minus 10 is four so line a is about four centimeters longer than line b now so line a and b are about blank centimeters combined 14 plus 10 add one more here that's 24 so it's about 24 centimeters combined now let's see line X. We have eight centimeters. Line Y, we have about nine centimeters. And line Z over here, it's about five centimeters. So let's see, lines X, Y, and Z are about blank centimeters combined. So eight plus five is 13, plus nine is 22. So it's about 22 centimeters combined. And line Z is about blank centimeter shorter than line X. So 8 minus 5 is 3, so line Z is about 3 centimeter shorter. And line X and line Y, 9 minus 8 is 1, so line X is about 1 centimeter shorter than line Y. Now it says line Y is about blank centimeters longer than line X. So line Y, or then line, wait, sorry. Line Y is about blank centimeters longer than line Z. So Y, 9 minus 5 is 4. So line Y is 4 centimeters longer than line Z. Now it says line X doubled is about how much longer than line Y. So doubled means like times 2. So 8 plus 8 is 16. So 16 is 7 more than line Y. So when line X gets doubled, it's 7 more than line Y. Alright, next page. So, number three, line J is 60 centimeters long. Line K is 85 centimeters long. Line L is 1 meter long. So, 1 meter is 100 centimeters. So, we'll just, we can also change that to 100 centimeters to help us. So, line J is blank centimeters shorter than line K. So, 85 minus 60, 8 tenths minus 6 tenths, that's 25. So line J is 25 centimeters shorter than line K. And B, line L, this one, is blank centimeters longer than line K. So 100 centimeters minus 85, that would be 15. So it's 100, it's 15 centimeters longer than line K. And line J doubled is blank centimeters more than line L. So J, 60 plus 60 is 120. So 120 minus 100 is 20. So when line J gets doubled, it's 20 centimeters more than line L. Now this is lines J, K, and L combined. 60 plus 85 is 145 plus 100 is 245. So combined, it's 245 centimeters. Number four, Katie measured the seat height of four different chairs in her house. Here are her results. So. Let's see, 51, 55, 97, and 65. How much shorter is the dining room chair than the counter stool? So 55 and 65. Six tens minus five tens is 110. Um, so then 65 minus 55 is just 10. So it's 10 centimeters shorter. Now it says, how much taller is a meter stick than the counter stool? So a meter stick, one meter is 100 centimeters. So we can write that there to help us. So 100 centimeters minus 65, that would give, that would give us 35. So it's 35 centimeters taller. And a meter stick and a love seat, so that's the love seat. 100 minus 51, that's 49. So it's 49 centimeters taller. Number five, Max ran 15 meters this morning. This afternoon, he ran 48 meters. 
how many more meters did he run in the afternoon? So 48 minus 15, that is 33. So then he ran 33 meters more. Now it says, how many meters did Max, Max run in all? So 15 plus 48, that's 63. So then he ran, Max, he ran 63 meters. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video helps. And please don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps on my channel. See you guys next time. Bye.